Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play on the Factory. This is episode 100. We finally made it. And uh, yeah, so last episode we made the creative tank, of course. And uh, we've got quite a bit of tanks, that's for sure. I kind of left it on the whole time. Uh, made sure to stop that because it was taking up all my inventory space in uh, AE2. So I have only about a few tanks left here um, of fluids or, uh, I guess fluids, I guess uh, minerals or um, chemicals is the word I was looking for. Because I went and set up the creative tanks around my base just for the time being. As you can see here, I've got about, I don't know, 10 or so creative tanks, maybe more than that. Some of these are for metals, some of these are for general fluids, like we have carbon, phosphoric acid, uh, styridine, or st uh, what's it called? Styrene, butadine, rubber, fluorine, rubber, bisphenol, and resin. Just to uh, keep the old craft system going. Oh, well, yeah, I also have a, a water, wait. Did I forget to put the water storage bus on there? Eh. It should be fine. I should have millions of buckets of water anyway. But, um, yeah. Let me just double check on that. Yeah. So anyway, uh, beyond that, I also set up... Let's see, I wanted to... Oh, dang it. So I set up this large wall of... Uh, solidifiers here and I'm just getting a picture for the video so um yeah <laughs> I've got mostly every material that I could ever need for any crafting setup you've got like you know your HSS vanadium chrome the void uh empowered blocks or the, the empowered blocks now we got void redstone I uh where's the rest oh yeah Diamantine, emeratic, all that. Even got uh, awakened draconium, draconium. And where's the other one? Where is it? Ah, neutronium. So yeah, we're, we're set. We, oh yeah, and omnium too. So we're set pretty much on materials. Uh, there might be a few straggler uh, metals I still need to set up, but we'll find those out in due time. Meanwhile, I do want to get into space, uh, start the building uh, of a space station and all that. Uh, let's see, I want to get rid of some things I don't want to put in that chest. I'll just put those around. Okay, so we have all of this stuff here. And I think I want to like go to the roof or something and set up a launch pad. That way I'll be close to my power system. So let's get some corp for building blocks. Why not? Get the dislocator out here. Okay, so I think like here should be good. Let me do like a, uh, a five by five. Okay. Okay, so I think a launch pad will go in the middle right here, right? And I'm just kind of figuring this out as I do this. Uh, let's see. Where is it in the quest book? At some point, you might consider venturing to the moon. You need to create a launch pad, 3x3 three three layout. The structure tower is formed from a column of structure tower blocks that holds your rocket upright. The first block goes adjacent to any side of the launch pad. Okay. So. That. The structure tower is formed from a column. Okay. Uh, with six structure tower blocks. You can only build a rocket five blocks high since any tower, any higher would exceed the height of the tower. To build a taller rocket, you need to build a taller tower. Okay, so the rocket assembly machine needs to be placed next to the launch pad, not on it. Uh, where is it? Do I have it? Yeah. Okay. Invalid launch pad structure. Do 
the let's see, the rocket assembly machine needs to be placed next to the launch pad now on it one block higher oh okay let me get my what's that that okay so put that down and then that rocket unscan okay so we're good there uh let's see uh it also needs to be supplied with rf okay let me just deal a solar panel I'll just put it like right here. Okay, cool. It's got power. Okay, uh, skin. Missing guidance computer. Okay, so let's go back to the quest book and figure this out. Guidance. Let's see. Guidance station. Let's see. Uh, guidance computer. I don't know if I need to put it somewhere. Missing guidance computer. Okay. I guess I need to figure out how to build a space rocket. Let's see. Advanced rocketry. Okay, I got the uh, wiki up here. Use the scan function of the rocket assembly machine to see your stats. Okay. Uh, once your rocket... Okay, you can now build your rocket. It must be made... Hmm. Let me uh, take a pause here. I'll be right back. I want to figure this out so I don't waste too much time doing this. Be right back. Okay, we are back everybody. So I'm gonna just try and um, Wing it So what I did is oops, I Equipped my spacesuit for the time being until I can get the airtight seal Which I can put on armor that will allow me to use non spacesuit armor to survive in space All right, so I went into the suit workstation and I installed a oxygen tank just so we'll have oxygen up there. What I'm going to do is go up there and see if I happen to get a space station. And if I do, then I'll teleport back and begin preparations to actually build the base. Now, the rocket, I think this should work. I basically built it piece by piece with the little launch pads, the tower, the computer, and the seat. And what I did eventually was I scanned it and I built it. Wait, why is it missing? Here, let me just do this again. So scan. Okay. As you can see, it's clear for liftoff. Build. Cool. Now, as far as fueling it, I think I need to do right click on this and then right click the rocket. Okay. I th Wait, no. Wait, uh, okay, I th doesn't have fuel. Does it need power, I wonder? I think it needs power. Okay, let me get a conduit. Okay, back to the roof. Honestly, I really should just, like, set a teleport to the rocket over here. Let me just do that. Okay, so if I come over here now and wire this, that, okay, that should be getting power, that is getting fuel, as you can see in the bottom left hand, or the left hand side of the screen, let me just, uh, okay, that's going to be constantly fueled because I got to create a tank there. So, destination, it doesn't know where we're going. Let's see, planet list, Earth. Is the moon somewhere around here? Oh, there it is. So there's the moon. I don't want to go to the moon. I want to go to space, so let's just try this and see what happens. Wait. Let's 
So I'm not sure if this is going to work out for us, but we'll see what happens. Destination unreachable. Okay, maybe I do need to do the moon. Right, let me just see something real quick. Now, if you want to return your can you change the destination in this manner? Uh, let's see. Advanced rocketry space space. Let me see if I can't find something really quick. I will be right back in a moment. Okay, I'm back. So I figured something I was doing was wrong, and I looked into it a little bit more, and it turns out I never did the space station quest that comes with the quest book. So we're going to do that really quick. So I'm already making the unpackager and a packager. Wait. Wait, did I what? Okay, the package wasn't done yet. I really have to make I have to wait for those to be made. Hmm. Okay. That's a bummer. Let's see. Unpackager, packager. Hmm. This is going to take a bit of time. So while that does that, uh, what else do we need to make? A space station. Space station, ID chip. That should be fine. Oh boy, are we running out of automation space? I don't think we should be good. Oh no. Okay, uh, find titanium wire. Do do. Oh, poopy. Wait, that should be fine. I should have titanium. Oh, wow, I don't even have that. Huh. Okay. Well, we've got plenty of titanium to spare, that's for sure. Wire mill. I'll just go ahead and put. Can I make this? Yeah, okay, good. I was going to say, I was going to put that wire recipe in the uh, old wire mill just because it doesn't really matter right now too much okay so we have that ship and we need the satellite bay now okay there we go that should be doable no problem should have titanium rods i'm pretty sure but if not i wouldn't be surprised okay we do and we're just waiting on the packager. Packager. I can spell it right. Okay, packager. And I only need the one, but what can you do? Okay, let me get down to the room here. And we'll just plop this down on packager and packager. Oh, yeah, I need some holders first. That would help. But let me go ahead and get that. And I accidentally put away the space station chip, so let me grab that back. Okay. It's back over here. Load, actually. Shoot. Um, gotta undo all this. Okay. Oh, okay. And get rid of that. Now, for the elite, I think it was. The assembler, like so. Save. And we'll pop this in here. And there. Should be able to craft this up. Yep, okay, good. So that is going. It might take a few minutes. It's because it appears to be a big recipe. You got some microchips, some annealed copper, the assembler. And the epoxy. So, okay. Let's see what the warp core is something I also need, which I already have automated, I believe, right? I don't know how this works out, but I'm just going to pick these up. Space station. So that still has some time to go. So let me cut here and I'll be right back after this finishes.
Okay, we are back. So we have the space station assembler now. So this is a whole... I need to probably take it up to the uh, roof. So let me see what the quest here says. So this quest... Okay. Only do them if you want to be able to explore the various planets offered by advanced rocketry and potentially build bases there or in space. Okay, claim that. Warp core. So the warp core is a multi-block structure. Oh boy. We're going to need a lot of things here. That you can build on the space station using the hollow projector for a building guide. While it's not required for the progression, you can spend some resources to travel to distant planets, either to explore them or to just change the background of your space station. The input hatch must be filled with dilithium. Okay. So we might have another blockade getting us into space. So I'm gonna need a hollow projector. Okay, so that is going to be a simple recipe for the most part. I should have that, right? Okay. Uh, hello. Oh. And then warp controller. I should have that. Plenty of that. There's a holo. We need titanium. Easy titanium, given that we have the creative tank. A uh, block of gold. Machine structure. Four. And a input hatch. We don't have that yet, I don't think. Uh, input hatch, input hatch. Get yeah, simple enough. There we go. Okay. Is that still making the hatches? Yeah, okay. So there's that. There's that. Okay. Huh. Thought I saw something out of the corner of my eye there for a moment. Okay, that should be the quest. Nice. Okay, let's see if I can't figure out how this works. All right, uh, rocket. Okay, here. Um, space station assembler. Invalid launch pad structure. Oh, you know what? Um, let me. Launch. I wonder though if I really need um, the space station launch pad or if I can just, if I need both of these. But uh, we'll see what happens in a moment. So I'll put that there. Put that there. Okay, I need to go make a daytime. Okay, uh, rocket. Let's see, uh, invalid launch pad structure. So I guess I need to Google advanced rocketry space station guide. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Okay, so I got a guide here. So I'm just looking at... Let me pause and see if I can not read up on this, and I will be back if I figure this out quickly. All right? See you shortly. 
Okay, everybody, I'm back for the time being. So I I did some looking around, did some reading. I think I have quite a bit to do before I can even make a space station and go into space. For one, I think I actually have to build the space station on a launch pad. So I'm just trying to think how to structure this. Thinking, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. This won't be the exact shape. Um, maybe like three, yeah. Something like this, maybe. Uh, let's see. Like this. I have no idea how this will look when it actually builds. I'm just kind of winging this here. Take care of this side. Okay. Oh, that doesn't look any better. Uh, ba -ba -ba. just gonna undo everything. So I. There's a lot of machines that I'm going to need, and I have made some of them, but I don't know if it's a comprehensive list of every machine that I need. What I might be doing is doing some research into what I need, and then come back in the next episode to complete everything, right? So there is your basic... Uh, shape for our rocket, right? And I don't know why I made it hollow because I need to have. Well, that's what I could do is put like a different material down there. No, not that. Uh, da, 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 where? Oh, there we go. Something like, like that. Right, and let's see, uh, that, that, there we go, oh, I need to get rid of that, Wait, uh, so yeah, maybe like something along this, uh, design. I'll put like glass in the middle, of course. But then, like, uh, I'm just thinking maybe we'll put like a. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oop. E. Oh, whatever. It's, that's fine. Uh, so, like, we'll do machines here, right? Maybe like these here. I'm putting the floor down here, so that's why that's like that. So let me just. Let me just do a floor real quick. Yep. Okay, so I might raise the roof a little bit more. Right, and let me just fill in that. Something like maybe another ring, another layer, give or take. Although, I guess in the end, it doesn't really matter too much because I do plan to build upon my space station. 
So there's that. And I guess I'll just put the roof in right now. Like that. Oh dear, ran out of iron blocks. Let me just go and get some more. And while we're here, I'll grab some fused quartz. Let me uh, take a look at this. Cutting machine, projection, observatory. Observatory? I don't know what this is all for. But anyway, um, get some more glass. Is there, let's see, what's well, not required? Hmm. Not really sure on that. Okay, so let's go back to the pad here. Uh, we'll get our wall. Oh, I guess it does work. Uh, for a second, I thought fused quartz didn't play nicely with this mod in a earlier episode, but I guess that it does work just fine. So that's good to know. So yeah, this is our basic space station, I suppose. Um, I am going to need to grab the controller here. And where'd it go? Ah, there's a stray block. Let me take care of that. Oh, what? Oh. Okay, uh... Don't know what constitutes. What's this? don't know what constitutes as a full rocket. So I may have to do some vanilla launch pad structure. I don't think I'm missing any blocks. I hope not at least. Uh, I guess I do need a power that would help. Let's see, I'm gonna just go grab another solar. We'll put it down here. Hmm. Let's see. Input hatch. Oh, I think I had stuff in here, right? Warp controller. Oh, I think I already have that in there. Let me just uh, break in here. Yeah, warp controller. Uh, hmm. Let's see. So satellite. Oh, I think that needs to go into the doodad here. Not that. I don't know if this matters. I think it's still missing something important. Uh, let's see. Where was my? I don't think that works. Uh, lathe crystallizer. I don't know what that, I don't think that does anything that we need. Um, warp core? Yeah, I don't even think I'm doing anything important here or worth of progress. Uh, hmm. Oh, I can get rid of that? Okay, cool. So yeah, I think I might need to do more research on this. Uh, we are actually at the end of the episode here, so that is a thing. And where did I put my chip? Oh, it's in the uh, outside, isn't it? Yeah, it's not doing anything. Okay, so I'm going to end it off here. I'll be back in the next one. Uh, as far as the world download, there will be some instructions in the video comments. 
so please take a look at that and uh if you have any questions well i'll try to my best to help out uh afterwards anyway hope you had hope you enjoyed i will see you next time ta-ta for now